I'm Bill. I'm one of the designers here at Pottery Barn Kids, and I get to design toys for a living. So in thinking about our holiday toy assortment, we wanted to come up with something that was extraordinary, something that would wow people, and something that kids would really look forward to, and creating a fantasy. And what if you and your friends lived in a luxury hotel, and that was your playground? In designing a toy, there's four steps. Step one is you have to start with a great idea. So step one is the time when you really get to fantasize and dream, and dream big. Think outside the box and really ask what if. What if we lived in a luxury hotel and we would have somebody open the door for us, people bring food to our room, drivers come and pick us up. Now that sounds like fun. Step two is you have to design all the pieces and parts. This is where one of our designers, Mimi, started to create the dolls and really make sure that they had the right uptown style. I came in to work on developing the dolls. We hired a fashion designer in New York to come up with all the original concept sketches and I took the sketches and modifying them so they looked good on the doll, which was a very different aesthetic, really very cute, it has long, kind of a long-legged fin but with this exaggerated head and big eyes and we came up with the little accessories, the dog carrier and so forth. Step three, technical drawings. So this is when we get really technical and we make sure that every material, every joint, every surface, every button, every piece of fabric is carefully chosen and that it is durable and safe. Everything is measured out and every detail is called out specifically. Step four, this is when the production samples come in and we review them for design, material, construction, color, and finish. We just go back and forth until we get it right and sometimes some modifications are made and I'm very happy with the fact the dolls are jointed. A lot of times you'll see in a place that the dolls are very stiff and yet we didn't want to do them with wire. So it all worked out really well. And then we perform a series of tests to make sure that every aspect, every material, every part of the construction is completely safe and passes all safety requirements. And then we do a series of user tests and guess who gets to test them? lots of kids. So once everything's approved, we start production. And then we take photos of it and put it in the catalog and on the internet. And then we ship it to the stores to sell for holiday. Oh, you are going to be so excited to see this dollhouse. It is over the top. Imagine this. You're in front of this grand hotel with great detailing and spindle balconies. As you walk through the front doors, the doorman opens the door for you and you check in at the reception desk and then as they take you up to your room at the penthouse on the top floor, you turn your chandelier on, empty your luggage and your clothes into your armoire and take a bath after a long flight from overseas. Welcome to your hotel. The Palace Park Hotel, every little girl's fantasy. The doors open this holiday.